to the Bonnie Z channel. I am your host, Bonnie Z, obviously. Uh, and tonight we have got something special planned. Uh, now that my character, Bonnie Z, has finished the Hogwarts Legacy game, woo! <laughs> we're going to move on to another character creation so that we're ready to go for any DLCs that come our way. He's cool. There's one in my fridge, but it's wifey's. Yes, do not touch it. Big trouble. Oh, this one's really th 3D. That's really cool. Oh, that was awesome. Um, now, if you're not sure about his backstory and uh, how I created him, you can go and check out my very first uh, video and stream of him and read the description for his character background. Um, very cool the way I created this character. Hey, he's awesome. Outside of school, however, due to your unique circumstances, the Ministry has graciously agreed to allow Professor Elizar Fig to help you hone your spell casting before escorting you from London to the castle for the start of term feast and the sorting ceremony. Yours sincerely, M. Weasley, Professor Weasley, Deputy Head Mistress. Let's go. Rowena Ravenclaw, where there's not much about her. The Slytherin family tree is very easy to find a ancestor or a name that we want to pick out um, together. And we can also choose some crazy love child, like between a Black and a Malfoy, for example. You know. So let's do that. That sounds like fun. Oh, come on, just... Okay, so we've got Salazar... Salazar Slytherin's family line was believed to be cursed. All female descendants produced no offsprings or died. Lovely. There's some fun facts. Little unknown area, which is why it's probably called the unwritten story, because there are so many unwritten family names here in the trees. And this is the problem I came across when I was creating my Ravenclaw. There is just these missing names and no one knows who they are. <laughs> Where this game is just planted perfectly in that little grey area. You know what, maybe I'll stay away from the black family name and we'll do a gamp instead. Alright, here are the four characters um, that you, my beautiful viewers, can choose who we are going to play. Ask your community. Pick our Slytherin. Let's uh, go. Acticus Burke or Bergen Burks? <gasps> no, guys, I just clicked. It's Burke. The surname is Burke. We're going to play a descendant of the founder of the shop, Bergen and Burks. It's a Slytherin. Oh my god, it's perfect. <gasps> oh, I'm so excited and invested. Why I do these things. It's got to fit in the role play. Oh, I love it. It's perfect. Look at this family members. It's insane. Burke family, House of Black. Oh, it just all fits. I love it. Oh, we can get Cinnamon Toast Crunch cereal here, but it's awfully expensive. Oh, Casbar, it's so good. I'll be talking about cereal. Okay. Okay, I'm losing my mind over Harry Potter family history and you guys are talking about Cinnamon Toast Crunch. That sounds about right. I love you, chat fam. <laughs> Look. The strange whose mother was disowned for marrying her father. Whose mother was disowned for marrying her father, Angus Whitlock. Okay. Awesome. All right, we're going to base this canvas on him, on this photo here. So, let's go. What do we think, ladies and gentlemen, of Herbert Burke, the, 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 well, the founding family of Borgen and Burks? Really? How cool is that? All right. I'm super keen. I'm super keen. Let's, uh, let's do this. Let's give a round of applause for Herbert. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
working with me the whole time. Ooh, he's, he's got this. He's really Tom handsome, Reed. like Tom Riddle. Batman, rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. How can you I not like that face? Vaguely defined destination than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> Who does he see there? So I feel like he looked at something then. And he got worried. Hmm. Anyone pick out anyone else pick up on that? Never picked up on that before, but yeah. Yeah, see? He totally saw Rookwood. I just realized that the Thestrals appear to you in that moment because you just witnessed death. I never picked up on that before. That's awesome. The key is a port key. <laughs> You're hurt. Yes, that got me good the first That's time as well. It. I jumped out of my skin. <laughs> Take this. It's Wigan well. Hard mode with no gear on. I should try it, evil faces. <laughs> Build trim, it's right up your alley, isn't it? Ah, oh, this moment for me How far did that would never get old. Alright, I can watch this scene just over and over again. Travel. It's so epic. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. So those rooms. It's so cool. Do you think the port key was meant to be I have to anticipate their attacks before they do them. Hard mode! Sun me to the stupefy, let's go. So, Great Smoky Pokey, I um, do Trivial Pursuit while I play my playthrough games. Look, look at all these questions I have. And I roll a dice, and then we do the colours, and then I ask the questions. It's great fun. <laughs> Sense of ambition, an eagerness for power. I guess. No, I know. I'm a Burke. My family founded Borgen and Burks. Ambition is like my thing. Slytherin. Let's go. In last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. Boo! Boo! Enough! It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but. Just that makes it better me. somehow. You are here to focus on your academic futures. Wow. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall that be was back amazing. in the morning to collect you for your first class. Thank you, Professor Weasley. You're welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep um, well. Just little things like the tapestries and the stone, the texture of the stone. If I find a candle, I'll show you how amazing the lighting uh, physics is in this game. But even like these lamps, check out each one of these lamps slightly flicker. Like how they would in the in in the nineteenth century. It's 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 just Sorry. outstanding. We're actually technically underwater right now, so we're kind of in the sewers under the Black Lake. So it's like being inside an aquarium. So I'm really interested to see once we get to the main part of the of the uh, common room if we're gonna see some um, animals or giant squid. Common that would be room. Cool. Wow. Can I help you? These stairs. I can't go up there. Oh. Why? Is that the seventh year room? I suppose I'm not allowed up there. Well, that's interesting. 
That's very interesting. Rebellion. Dealing with Discord stuff. Oh, that's okay. Kelpie statue. This statue depicts the Kelpie, a shapeshifter water demon native to Ireland and Great Britain, which usually takes the form of a long-maned horse. The largest Kelpie ever reported is the Loch Ness Monster in Scotland. I love this game. Approach a hippogriff. Answer is... It is best to bow and wait for it to bow back. That's a very long-winded answer. But yes, congratulations everyone. You all got it right. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Cool. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Well, seven is the most magical number, so it kind of makes sense. Um, now, let's but do something we'll do ten minutes. Larger. Well, poor ominous. He was leaning against that table then. That was great. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Heck yes. Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in cross bonds, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll This kid's curls, super impressive. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. It's full so. Come on. Stupid one. There goes my wager. Levioso. Woohoo! I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, excuse, Deke. Aw, Deke. Ah, so cute. There you are. I trust your... What does Cho Chang order from the trolley during Harry's fourth year trip to Hogwarts? That's a toughie. What does Cho Chang order from the trolley during Harry's fourth year trip to Hogwarts? Got it. Sure, it's pumpkin pasties. Yay! Castle's onto it, and the answer is I'm pretty sure she orders two. Two pumpkin pasties, please. Wasn't actually that bad, was it? So, hit notify me if you would like to. But thank you so much, everyone, and I shall catch you on my next stream. Bye for now. Mwah. I just killed Salazar Slytherin.